name's Carrie Sampson. I'm a fifth year apprentice at Local 17. So I'm the first female smart sheet metal worker in the state of Rhode Island. And I live in Warren, Rhode Island. It has a really small town feel. It's near Providence. It's south of Boston, so it's near the city. It's surrounded by woods and water. I was thinking about going into welding and one of my friends mentioned sheet metal to me and I explained to him that I had no idea what sheet metal even was. And then he explained that I didn't need to have any experience whatsoever, that I would go through a five-year apprenticeship program for free while working and making money. I decided to give it a shot. It was all brand new to me. Um, but the guys were very patient with me. You know, if I had questions, they would sit down and answer them and explain everything. I just learned from there and just kept going. And I've learned quite a bit. I've learned CAD, I've learned drafting, I've learned welding, I've learned fabricating ductwork, measuring, and right now I'm currently learning testing and balancing in school. So in the morning I wake up around 4.30, drive to work, and then on Tuesday and Thursday nights I go to school from 4.30 to 7.30 in Providence. Depending on the job I'll be doing different things. Some jobs have a lot of welding going on and I might be the ground person or the fire watch. Um, other jobs, I would be installing the ductwork, you know, in, in the air. Some of the jobs, I'm just like the helper. Um, and the day really flies by because you're constantly learning and working. So we're here at Providence College cutting the exhaust into the um, bathrooms and the dorm rooms. So what I love about sheet metal is that I can drive by a building and say that I built that. I see the job from beginning to end to the finished product and it makes me feel proud. So my job prior to this, I was a hairdresser and a makeup artist. My hairdressing job wasn't really great pay. Um, I did have some benefits with that. The makeup artist job was good pay but it had no benefits at all. And now I'm able to help my daughter go through nursing school, afford my own place, put food on the table. I definitely have better work-life balance now that I'm in the union. I make better money, I'm more comfortable, I have better benefits. I can do what I want to do with my free time. So I love fishing. I was able to, my first year apprenticeship, buy a small aluminum boat, and now I own a 20-foot center console. So it's two o'clock, I'm leaving work, I'm gonna go home and relax. So when I was in Las Vegas at Trades Women Build Nations, we marched around the strip chanting, wicked smart, wicked smart. Wicked smart, wicked smart. And it was an invigorating and empowering and invincible feeling. It was a feeling of unity and support, togetherness and belonging. If a female came to me and asked me what I thought about them joining the sheet metal industry, I would say go for it, 100%. So once I journey out, I'm going to shadow somebody um, in a testing and balancing company and after two years, I'll be able to get my testing and balancing license. I feel like there are even more opportunities for me out there that I'm not even aware of, and I have a lot of room to grow.